Hi, you guys. Happy Wednesday to you guys. This is Prophetess of Phil Sabrina Acapo and wanted to bring you a prophetic word that the Holy Spirit spoke into my spirit on today. And as with any prophetic word, you would absolutely want to go to the Lord in prayer, testing the spirit to affirm and confirm that perhaps this prophetic word is for you. Holy Spirit, I invite you in to take full charge, to take full control, to take full access. I decrease as you increase. Allow me to bring forth your word, with your glory, with your power, with your grace, with your mercy, telling your story so your name can be glorified for the winning of souls to the gospel of Jesus Christ. In Jesus Christ's mighty name that I do pray, amen, 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 and amen. Tidy, you guys, of this prophetic word is what was sent to your Mordecai is being returned to your Hammonds. What was sent to your Mordecai is being returned to your Hammond. Let me jump off into this word and I declare and I decree that you get a revelation and an understanding of what the Holy Spirit is saying because he is saying something spectacular here and something is now happening here. He is making it crystal clear in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. So you guys, I'm walking actually on yesterday in the park and the Holy Spirit began auctioning and speaking into my spirit what was sent to harm Mordecai is being returned to your Hammonds. Holy Spirit is saying everything that was sent to destroy you is working out for your good. And I hear Romans 8 and 28 that all things work together for the good of those who love God to them that are called according to your purpose. And your favor. Not only is it working out for your good, but for your favor and the trap that was set for you that your enemies are falling into the very trap that they had set out for you. The gallow that was set for you, they are about to hang themselves on it. The Lord is also causing your enemies to celebrate you. Esther 7 and 10. So they impaled Haman on the pole he had set up for Mordecai. Then the king's fury subsided. The Lord is saying not only what he did to Mordecai, but what he did did to his wife Esther and was trying to do to their people. The Lord has said he has seen everything. He has seen every scheme. He has seen every tactic. And the Lord is saying it is not happening. The Lord has said he has stepped in and it is not happening. It will not go forth. The Lord is wanting you to know that he has already released you and you have entered into a position of peace. The Lord wants you to know that this is a time that he's exposing your enemies and he is placing judgment on them because of you, because you are his beloved. And because of just like David, your heart, Romans 12 and 19, beloved, never avenge yourselves, but leave the way open for God's wrath in his judicial righteousness. For it is written in scripture, vengeance is mine. I will repay, says the Lord. Holy Spirit is saying, just like Mordecai, you are about to be rewarded because of your heart, because of your integrity integrity and that he is changing your wardrobe and giving you a robe of honor and he is causing your name to be great amongst the nations just like he did for Mordecai you are being lifted Psalm 75 and 7 but God is the judge he puts down one and lifts up another the tables have turned on your enemies and you have won the victory. Holy Spirit is saying their plans will never stand nor succeed when I have not commanded them to proceed. The Holy Spirit is saying your enemies are being removed. Daniel 2 and 21, he changes the times and the seasons. He removes kings and a 
establishes them. He gives wisdom and knowledge to the discerning. What was sent to Mordecai is being totally and completely reversed. Put yourself in the place of what's happening in this word that is being given to you on today. You are Mordecai and your enemies are Haman. And what was sent to Mordecai has been reversed and is being returned back to your Hammonds. Holy Spirit is saying change is evident and change is here in this new era, in this new season, in this new time, in this new month, and in this new year. What was sent to harm you has in fact indeed promoted you and catapulted you. That's said the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Like Share and subscribe, you guys. Don't forget to hit that noti bell where you guys can be notified each time I upload a video. Welcome, 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 welcome to all of my new subscribers, you guys. Welcome to the fam. I pray that this word has really gave you a revelation and an understanding of what the Holy Spirit was saying. The Lord is saying, Hammond was the one that was loyal. Hammond was the one that was brave and he was the very one that saved his people, that gave the inside scoop to Esther. And Esther relayed that information to the king. And this is the very reason why the king rewarded Mordecai for his bravery. So he, so the Lord is saying the same thing. He has no respect of persons that happened to Mordecai. This is the very exact thing that he is doing in this end time and end season for you. What was sent to Mordecai is being returned to Hammond, and instead you are being honored. Instead, you're being celebrated. He's making your name great. He is giving you a robe. He's changed your wardrobe and giving you a robe because you have stepped into your birthright. You have stepped into your rightful position. The Lord has said all along, it was your mission and you will finish strong. What was sent to your Mordecai is being returned to your Hammond. That said the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Like, share, and subscribe. You guys keep the comments, the likes, the shares, the words of encouragement, the prayers coming because they, I'm telling you, they keep me afloat. Just like Noah and his family. You know, I always use this scenario getting on that Oh, the Lord is saying, because Noah built it and Noah was able to make it, so will you build it and so will you make it. Nothing will be shaken and stirred because you have been placing him first place and you have heard the voice of the Lord and to move you in a position where you won't be out of sight or out of bound. But the Lord is saying he's ordering and orchestrating you step by step by step, level upon level upon level where you can be celebrated, where you can be honored. And the Lord is saying blessings that are wonders without numbers. What was sent to harm you has worked out for your good. It has brought you into your new era, a new dimensional level. The Lord is saying never better. Thus said the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you so much for the super thanks. Thank you so much for sowing into this ministry. It does not go unnoticed. I truly appreciate all of you guys and the Lord rewards those ones who diligently seek after him and hearken unto his voice. The Lord is saying you'll be blessed in the city and in the field coming in and going out. You will be the head and not the tail above and not beneath a lender and not a bar because you chose to walk out in obedience. The Lord is saying he's rewarding you the same way he rewarded Mordecai. He is honoring you the same way he honored Mordecai because of your integrity, because of your bravery, you will finish strong because the Lord has his hands on every situation in your life because you have included him in. And he has his hands on you because you have been asking him everything that you do, every step that you take, every move that you make. So that the Lord go before you and make all your crooked pathways straight and grant you his grace and unmerited favor and lead and guide you 
in order because God is the God of order. This is your quarter and the Lord is wanting you to know this is also your season of reward. This is also your season of honor and nothing is going to be able to block it. Nothing is going to be able to stop it. So everything that was coming at you, the Lord has sent it back in reverse to the sender and what was sent to your Mordecai is being returned to your hammers. Thus said the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Take care and we will most certainly talk on the next. May the Lord richly bless each and every one of you guys and see each and every one of you guys through to the greatness of success of God's best. I love you and I am always praying for you. Take care. God bless you. Bye-bye.